it's swimsuit season. Carrie Marsh is here from Chalet Magazine to walk us through it. Now, everyone's favorite thing to shop for, right? Yeah, no kidding. Don't you love it? Here's the thing, though. Swimsuits now, there's such a variety. You don't yes. have to wear, you know, like a full-on dress with bloomers like the nope. 20s, but nope. you can still be somewhat covered up yes. and on trend. So before we even hit the stores, I want to say two things. Yeah. Give yourself time. Do not be in the taxi on the way to the airport and just stop in at the store. <laughs> oh, no, 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 Schedule no. Schedule no. a good hour in that department. This right. is the bay. They have a huge selection. Book the time so that you can really try different styles. Yeah. The second thing is take a little time before. A little bronzer, a little oh. lotion, so you don't have that horrifying moment in the change room where you see your winter skin, yeah. right? And you're blinded. How and about your winter hair? You Bikini know? wax, yes. perhaps. Do a little prep work. So that you're yes. not like completely outraged, that, right? You yes, don't need and that. Horrified. Okay. Okay, now we'll start shopping. Now we're ready. Okay, we're ready. Let's go try on the suit. So one of our favorite trends this year is this plunging neckline. Yes. It's universally flattering. I know that seems awfully low, but it's gonna give you a really nice long line. Yes. Lengthen the torso. I like this one because it's actually covered up, but it still gives you that same effect. It's so sexy. It is sexy. It's super great. Rash guards. Mm -hmm. It's moved from surf to mainstream swimwear. So I did not know what a rash guard was. Yes. The rash guard is sort of like the t-shirt, the skin tight yeah. t-shirt, which makes sense if you are a surfer, but now everyone's doing them. Yes. Well, a lot of people are, are doing them and it's gonna protect you from the sun. Exactly, and right? it just covers you up a little bit and you can even put it over top of a bikini. Mm -hmm. And they come in t-shirts, they come in crop tops, they come in the full one with a little broth. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's a really great option if you want some sun protection, which is huge all for of the paddle borders as well. Yeah, They're and doing a lot any of that. kind of uh, beach sports. Yeah. Now, we love this high waisted retro look. I love that a two piece can be anything but an itsy bitsy yellow polka dot. Teeny bikini. tiny it's little bikini. Exactly, right? It's, right. It looks great on a feminine, curvy figure. Okay. And now the last trend that we love so much is this bandeau strapless look. Okay, the bandeau. I think even no matter what kind of shape you're in, most people feel okay about their shoulders. Yeah. So that's a nice thing to show off. Right. Again, very retro. We love this black one. It's almost like a little dress. Okay, so a lot of women feel very comfortable in this. And you were saying in your notes that a bandeau is, is nice if you have that athletic figure. Exactly. You can show off those shoulders. Yes. You, you still uh, have some coverage for your belly. Exactly. You were saying the high-waisted for a curvy girl. That's right. That can look really good on a curvy girl. Yep. This one is awesome. So cute, right? I love all the sort of fashion details in swimwear Beautiful. right now. Beautiful. Okay, so let's actually see some different uh, body shapes in action in different suits because I know for me when I watch TV, I look for people yes. that have the same shape as me and then I think, okay, I can wear that I can too. do that. Right? Yes. So let's see model number one. All of these suits today that we're going to be looking at are from Anita and Anita is genius at really designing for the body. Okay. So this is Mackenzie. She has quite hey. an athletic figure. Yeah. And we liked to kind of go against the grain with this one and give her a really feminine look. She's got those little jewel details on the top of her bikini. She's got the little ties. Mm -hmm. The top has a bit of padding, so she's going to get some extra curves going. Right. You don't just have to be in a Speedo if you're a sporty athletic figure. And we love the feminine print on this one. That is very nice. So by athletic figure, you mean that, you know, she's got some definition yeah, and maybe right. not as many curves as some exactly. of us out there. So it's nice if you can bump up the femininity of the look. Exactly. Very nice, exactly. Mackenzie. Give her a big round of applause. I know it's not easy to come out here in a swimsuit, honey. Thank you. So what would you call this shape? Gorgeous. Tia is wearing a full figured bikini. Yeah. And now we love that she's taken the time to find exactly the right fit. Anita mm -hmm. does fantastic fits. We love that the cup comes high up on the on the on the chest so everything is contained because right. who wants to worry about that when they're yeah. swimming. If you want to run out of the water, you want your suit to come with you. Yes. Exactly. Otherwise, I want, that very also. I want that also. <laughs> Um, I love that this is real bra design. She can adjust yes. the strap so that it fits her exactly. Nice wide strap around the rib cage. Yeah. Um, it's really going to stay in place. And the suit covers her backside, mm -hmm. which is nice. Yeah, so you've got a high waist going on there. Yeah. You know, there have been so many times when I thought to myself in my bra and underwear, I love the way this fits. Why can't I get a swimsuit that just looks like this? Exactly. So I like and the fact that the top here. mimics a bra. Yeah. You get all of those features that you yeah. would get in a all bra. All the engineering. All the engineering. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. Good <laughs> word. <laughs> Thanks so much, Tia. You look lovely. Very nice. I should try that high waist thing. I've never really gone for it. Andrea.
We're yeah. showing off a gorgeous uh, suit for a bustier woman. Mm -hmm. Again, it's got that bra um, lift and support. And we love, if, yeah, I'll just ask you to, exa oh, that's exactly. Oh, pretty, nice it's detail. almost like an evening gown. I just love it. It kind of softens the look so it doesn't look quite so um, technical. Yes. And I love that long line. That one piece always gives that the longest possible line. Lovely. So, you know, there are a lot of women out there that think I have to be in a one piece. Try both a one piece and a two piece on Absolutely. because you never know what's going to suit your figure. Exactly. Just because you're a plus size girl does not mean you necessarily need to be in no a way. in a one piece. I, I mean, Thanks frankly, so much. That was lovely. Wear what makes you feel good. Yeah. Yeah. Wear what works for you. So this is a nice one as well. Gorgeous. I like the detail. Yeah. You've got the black and the beautiful fuchsia there. So Stephanie is wearing a suit that really suits an hourglass figure. Right. We call this kind of color blocking illusion blocking. Mm -hmm. So when you wear dark on the outside, it's going to minimize. It's going to make your waist look even smaller when that color starts slightly inside. Yes. And then that waist detail, which draws your eye here to the smallest part of you. Yeah. I it's like that. It's just super flattering. And again, I think there's so many great one pieces out there. I think that the, the bikini, it doesn't have to be the end all and be all that right. we think that we're working towards in the summer. I think it's about finding a suit that really fits your body. Yeah, the important thing is putting the suit on, regardless yes. of what the suit is. We're going to talk right. a lot more about that a little bit later in the show, but thank you, Carrie, for all the tips.